So I got involved in gangster racing actually I was at 14. I heard my friends who started to steal bicycles. From stealing bicycles, housebreaking. When you are deep in crime already committing it, the feeling that you have is a feeling of regret. Because I loved my mom. If my mom can hear about this, how will that make them feel? I ended up in prison. It was a 20 year sentence at the age of 17. So that's when I felt like everything started to crumble down. When I was interned in Trakenstein prison, it was a survival of the fittest. At one day, I went to make a phone call. As I call, a younger cousin of mine picked up the phone. When she picked up the phone, I asked, where is my aunt? And then she said that, no, your aunt is not here empty. They went to a funeral, you don't know. And I asked her, they went to bury who? And she said that, no, they went to bury your mom. So like, for me, it was like the end of the world. I, I said to my heart that, you know what, the only person that I was living for, it was my mom. When she passed away, I don't see there will be any restraint for me not to go to be the worst person. But at one day, you were finishing, stepping, fighting with each other. The blood on the floor, and a small voice spoke to me, said that, MT, if you do not make a drastic change in your life, that will be your blood. And the prayer that I prayed that day with two prayers, I said that, God, if you are willing to be followed by me, you are going to protect me in this room. The second one, I want to be a person of impact. I was released uh, on parole, still confused. I never worked before. So the best place that I can come to, it was Message Trust. So the Message, they played a role in my life while I was in prison. And they trained me in entrepreneurship, which has helped me to start a company. So I volunteered at the Message. Then they say that MT, there's a position that is opened and I'm doing it now. I'll go in prison and teach entrepreneurship. And on the outside, I'll train the guys to be job ready. When I walk out of prison, I walk out with hope. And when I'm walking back in prison, I bring hope to the guys. I know that I cannot make right the wrongs that I have made. But what I've realized in life is that every day you've been given a new clean sheet. And I'm doing that to write a new different story for myself and for the other guys. That when they read my life, they know that he has made some mistake, but he has changed. And through his change, he has impacted many. That's how I want to be remembered. But not as a force of destruction, but as a force of change.